Greetings everyone. Bandu Patra brings to you the news highlights of 11th November 2022. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court has held that an application seeking to assign a review petition to a particular high court judge should be placed before the Chief Justice of the High Court on the administrative side and not to be dealt on the judicial side. The court while observing that civil court has jurisdiction to try a suit filed by a borrower against a bank or financial institution has held that independent suit filed by borrower against bank or financial institution cannot be transferred to be tried along with application under the DRT Act 1993 the court has held that a letter of credit is independent of and unqualified by the contract of sale or underlying transactions the court has held that the most meritorious person should be appointed as the vice chancellor of the university from and amongst the other eligible meritorious candidates out of the panel of the names recommended by the search com selection committee the court has held that state government's decision not to recommend further recognition to new ba colleges on the need or requirement basis cannot be said to be arbitrary The court while observing that registering authority cannot sit in appeal over decision of court permitting sale at particular price has held that public auction carried out through court process or receiver is the most transparent manner of obtaining the correct market value of property the supreme court has ordered the premature release of all six convicts in the rajiv gandhi assassination case while noting that convicts displayed good conduct in the prison and had been behind bars for a very long period starting with the delhi high court the delhi high court has held that unauthorized constructions are a bane to the orderly development of the city which is bursting at its seams and they cannot be allowed to continue to stand in perpetuity the high court has held that after the enactment of tribal reforms act 2021 appeals challenging order of patent office would lie before the concerned high courts having territorial jurisdiction over appropriate office from where the patent application originates The High Court has directed the center to take action against five domain name registrars for non-compliance of judicial orders and also consider if those domain name registrars should be permitted to continue to offer their goods and services in India if they are not giving effect to orders of the Indian courts. The High Court has directed Tata Power Delhi Distribution Limited to provide electricity connections to Pakistani Hindu migrants who are residing in the city's Adarsh Nagar area within a period of 30 days. News highlights from high courts in other parts of the country. The Kerala High Court while considering the issue of overhanging cables, footpath maintenance and reckless driving by vehicles has directed commissioner of police to ensure that no vehicles are allowed to be parked on designated pedestrian areas and footpaths the calcutta high court has held that an objection on the maintainability of writ petition cannot be raised at the 11th hour and that such an objection cannot go into the route of judicial proceedings unless such an objection is made on a point of pure question of law or inherent lack of jurisdiction The Jammu and Kashmir and Ladakh High Court has held that certificate of payment is not required if an employer prefers to question the award of interest or penalty and in case a composite award both under section 30 sub clause 1 sub sub clause A and sub sub clause AA of Workmen's Compensation Act is assailed. This concludes the news highlights for today. Thank you.